Technology has saved many of us from isolation during the pandemic, but for those who don't have access to a Zoom or a FaceTime, it's been especially hard. That's why one teenager made it his mission to help others with disabilities like his own to get the devices that they need. Sangeeta Lau has Sebastian's inspiring story. Hi guys, from donating clothes for struggling families, <coughs> collecting pumpkins for soup kitchens, and even delivering Christmas presents. 17-year-old Sebi has been showing random acts of kindness to strangers since the first lockdown. Water. Watering people's plants. And what else? Washing people's garage doors. Garage doors. Um, giving out lo a lot of lottery tickets. Lottery tickets. And what do you say? When we give out a lottery ticket to a random stranger, can we remember? Hello, strangers. It's your lucky day. A lucky day. Sebi has learning difficulties which affects his speech. But when screens became the main way to socialise through lockdown, he started raising thousands of pounds to buy phones and tablets for other disabled children, keeping them connected in isolation. Sebi wanted to speak to one of his friends on a Zoom call, but this uh, particular boy didn't have any IT equipment, didn't have a telephone, or we didn't have a, a tablet or a laptop or anything, did you, Sebi? So far, he's raised more than £15,000. Some of that money has been used to help fund a drama project for vulnerable children. He's an inspiration for young people with special educational needs. That's a start. But he's also been, he's sprinkled magic all over our community. Something that's been recognised by one of Sebi's heroes. Sebi, you are a wonderful young man and you are a true lockdown legend. A title Sebi intends to keep. Despite smashing his fundraising targets, he plans to continue helping his community this year too, because he says there's no limit to how much kindness you can show. Sangeeta Lal, ITV News.